Hey guys, I'm not in my car, but we're going to try something. The reason why we're not in my car today is because we're going to be trying something it took forever to find. The Pepsi Nitro, as well as the Pepsi Nitro Vanilla Draft. Why? These drinks are actually nitrogen infused. See? So it's supposed to have a... Uh, kind of like beer, where it's nice and foamy. So I even have a... Uh, a nice mug for this. We're going to read the instructions real quick. And I will show you them. Pour hard, admire, and enjoy. Seems simple enough. So, first we're going to try the Pepsi Nitro. Oh, shit. Well, let's, uh... Like it says, pour hard in a cup. Okay, as you can see, it kind of looks like uh, beer. It's got a little head on it. A bunch of little micro bubbles. Uh, we lost a decent amount of soda. But let's give this a shot, shall we? Hmm. It tastes like Pepsi, like a flat Pepsi. That's weird. It, it does have a creaminess to it, but it tastes like a flat Pepsi. You know, if you have a bottle, you drink a little more than half of it, put the cap back on, and then you forget it overnight. You take it, you drink it. Tastes like that. It's flat. Um, the bubbles it has is there. It has that creaminess. It just, it does not aerate the soda, carbonate the soda like carbon uh, dioxide does. It's not bad, but I don't know, when you're used to the, the carbonation, of a, of a soda, it's how uh, this is a little weird. I have an idea actually, but that's gonna have to come up uh, on another video. Um, using this in a cocktail might have a different texture to it, but we'll have to see how it works. But now let's try the other soda. Okay, now it's time to try the vanilla draft cola. We're really not sure when it opens. I remember I saw how it. Worked last time. Got it all over again. Pour it hard like this is. Alright. Looks the same, actually. Let's give it a shot. I definitely get more creamierness from it. I don't know if it's because the head, uh, it's more infused or if it's because the vanilla. And when I get vanilla, I automatically think cream soda. Uh, Pepsi flavor, as far as that goes. It's very watered down, very muted. I'm getting Pepsi flavor, but it's not very strong at all. That would be good in a uh, root beer float. Might be able to find something for um, this to to go in a cocktail or something. Uh, unfortunately, those cocktails are going to have to wait. I'm currently uh, doing uh, doing a round of antibiotics, and doctor said no alcohol, so we're going to go with that. At the end of the week, I should be good to go. Um, got a few other things I want to show. Including some things that have to do with some tequila. Uh, canned tequila drinks. It's going to be really cool. Keep an eye out for that. I've actually been trying to get these since they came out in, on March 28th. I just got these today. Today is actually, what, the 19th of April. It took me forever to find these. And they just want to explode in my face. They're decent enough. Um, again, 
they're kind of flat tasting because the carbonation doesn't well you don't want to say carbonate the the carbonation the bubbles don't really give that typical soda flavor or texture it is a, lot, a little bit creamier uh, but because of that it tastes flat the bubbles don't work how they do when it's uh, carbonation i'm glad I, I found them finally gotta try them um if you can find them i'd say give them a shot N probably not really worth taking too much time to hunt them down to, to, to find yeah that way definitely not worth paying nine bucks for a single can from amazon like they wanted to charge me i ended up paying about ten dollars and change after taxes for both uh, four packs much better than paying nine dollars for a single can uh, but it was a pain in the ass to find. It's definitely going to be hard to find. But if you can find it, give it a shot. It's an interesting experience. Anyway, that's all for now. Thanks for watching. If you have any suggestions, questions, comments, concerns, put them down in the comments below. And I'll see you in the next video. Have a good night, guys.